Hey everyone, so we are going to North Carolina today. It's been a heck of a night and morning because Sam got sick yesterday. Of course he did, the day before we're supposed to go to North Carolina. And he is feeling better today, but still not feeling great, but we're gonna go because he's tested negative for COVID three times. So we're gonna go and hopefully he feels better tomorrow, but we're so disorganized. Like it feels like we're not even going, nothing's packed, everything's a mess. So, and we also have to leave soon, but I did want to go grab breakfast, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. So we're going to rush, get ready, and maybe go grab some donuts. If not, we'll just head to my Nana's to go to the airport. It is 8.59. Got our donuts. Definitely late to the airport, but already checked the bag and hoping that security won't be too long. 9.03 and we're in. There is no one for security. 9.30, just waiting for our flight. Looks like it delayed about 10 minutes, but we're just chilling now. I did accidentally uh, so... just hit my head, but it's okay. 12 o'clock and we are going to the rental car place. Our flight got in about 20 minutes early, even though there was supposed to be a 10 minute delay. Just a pretty quick flight. Finally at Baby Bop. Almost dropped my phone. Baby Bop, Sam's still getting his food, but I got a small bowl with white rice, soup, tuna noodles, chicken, carrots, cucumber, and then their original lemonade. So excited to eat this. It just looks so good. We are all checked into our hotel room and I just love these pictures right by the bed. We're going to not just a fry guy for dinner and then I think a free music event at Fuqua Arena. Change of plans because I really want an ice cream sandwich. We're going to Fairwinds Chocolates and then we're going to go to Not Just a Fry Guy and then hopefully the free music event in Fuqua Arena. And our ice cream sandwiches. Okay, so I also did a Rice Krispie Treat because I haven't had one since I got diagnosed with celiac disease because I haven't been able to find a safe one. So really excited. And then, oh, I dropped my ice cream sandwich. I got my ice cream sandwich, it's safe. It, it just looks absolutely delicious. So I'm so excited to eat this and I'm probably gonna eat it now on the way to go get dinner. Sam got an ice cream sandwich too. So excited. Getting food at Not Just a Fry Guy. We are getting food at Not Just a Fry Guy and this is just absolutely beautiful. I got Sprite and then the cheeseburger meal without the cheese, so pretty much a hamburger meal. Sam got the hot, hot honey chicken. Is that what it's called? Hot. Honey, yes. Or hot honey something. Hot honey peanut cheese fries. We did add chicken. Fries. So that's a new one that we haven't had yet. That one looks pretty good and I'm so excited to have this for dinner tonight. I couldn't stand the bugs so now we're eating in the car. But once we're done, or at least when Sam's done, then we're gonna go to the music event. We made it. <laughs> Section at Food Lion. It's really not a lot here. This Rice Krispie Treat smells amazing. This is from the Fairwinds Chocolate Place, if I pronounce that correctly. We just went to Food Lion. They didn't really have everything that we were looking for, so now we're gonna go to Walmart, but man, I'm so excited to eat this Rice Krispie Treat. This is so soft and warm, probably because it's really humid outside, but man, I haven't had a Rice Krispie Treat since I got diagnosed, so this is big for me. This is huge, I'm so happy. After we went to Walmart and Target and even Food Lion last night, we were so tired, came home, Sam fell asleep immediately. I did. <laughs> and then I just got showered and went to bed. So now it's like, what time was it? I just looked, it was like 9.49 or something. Yeah, something like that. So we're going to go to Fount Coffee for breakfast and then I don't really know our plans. It's gonna be 91 I think today, so probably inside for a lot of today, but I'm excited to get some breakfast. I got the morning scramble with avocado, hot chocolate, Sam got some sort of pastry cake, and then a That is a caramel apple cake, and then Sam just got his acai bowl. And I'm still working on my food, so he'll probably still finish before me, but that's okay. So far, this is all absolutely delicious. We are now at JP's Bakery. And they also have pastries and all types of foods in Benson, North Carolina. So we haven't been here yet. 
So very excited to try this place out and the downtown here is really cool. After this, we're going to visit my dad, but this is kind of on the way. So let's check it out. Okay, so they had an overwhelming amount of options, like so many foods to pick from. I don't even know how many, probably at least 50 different items. They have like baked goods, breads, brownies, cinnamon rolls, cookies. They have, um, they even had, I think, like ravioli and meals. And like, it was just so, so much in pizza. Like there were so many options. So very overwhelming. Um, my dad ended up getting some two different cheesecake bars, cookie dough and peanut butter brownie. I picked that up for him because we're on our way to his house now. And then I also got peanut butter brownie. I got a cinnamon roll, an apple cream cheese, like cupcake thing. I'll take a video of um, them when we go to eat them, as long as we can get a video before we devour them. But everything's celiac safe, which is amazing. So, so excited to try their food out. Here is the peanut butter brownie. I love that they list all the ingredients out, what it contains, and this is certified gluten-free. So I'm gonna try this one out first. All right, so we're all taste test. Good, very dense. Let me see. Good. Nice. Took a bite of this and it's just, it's very, very good, very rich. Here is a gluten free apple cream cheese muffin, certified gluten free. This looks so good. All right, taste test of the apple cream cheese muffin. Mm. Yeah. There's like little pieces of apple in it. Kind of tastes like apple crisp in a muffin form. Wait, what are you eating now? Cookie dough cheesecake. You're eating it too fast. I'm gonna get videos. It's good. I'm just taking one bite. Yeah, this is good. Gluten-free blueberry crumb round cake. This looks really, really good. Sam got, I think, the cookie dough cheese cake it down that he made me reach back and throw my back out for. But, no, it's fine. I'm okay right now. So I'm gonna try this out. Honestly, it tastes just like a really sweet blueberry muffin. And Sam said that his uh, cookie dough cheese cake bar is pretty good. We are about five or six minutes away from my dad's house. We are now inside where my dad lives and we're about five minutes away from his house. Drive really wasn't too bad since we split it up at the bakery. Ollie. Hi, Percy. Aw. This is Percy. And Ollie. Percy likes his butt scratched. All he likes belly rubs. We have been at my dad's house for a few hours, just talking, chilling with the cats. And now we're going to some sort of uh, restaurant and we're gonna hang out there for a little bit. And then we're gonna go back to near Raleigh. I think we're, I think it's Benson, North Carolina again, to go to Koa Hawaiian barbecue for dinner. We just left my dad's place. We are now going to Koa Hawaiian barbecue. So we have a bit of a drive, but we're on our way and it's just absolutely beautiful here in North Carolina. Randomly raining now, but just lots and lots of cornfields. Here at the Koa Hawaiian or Koa Hawaiian barbecue. We are at the Koa Hawaiian barbecue food truck. So excited they are out of the chicken, but I did get the fried rice beef plate and Sam did too. Here is the beef fried rice with looks like mac salad, pineapple, and ginger teriyaki. I believe they were out of the chicken. The Hawaiian barbecue chicken was what I wanted and I don't eat seafood, so I didn't have the shrimp. So I'm excited to try this. The pineapple and mac salad. I'm just gonna wait. The pineapple and mac salad is great, which it was last time too. And this is pretty good too. I definitely prefer the Hawaiian barbecue chicken though. Sam has already done his meal. So good. How was it? So good. Love so the good. spicy sauce. Oh yeah, I did not get spicy sauce. So good. I got regular sauce, but I didn't even use it. But I'm still like barely halfway through. 
but it's fine. This is really good so far. This is the cinnamon roll from JP's pastry. We're going back to the hotel real quick to put all this stuff in the fridge and I haven't finished it all. And then I'm not sure what we're going to do after that, but it's around, it's almost eight o'clock. So it's still getting a little dark outside, but the sunset is beautiful. The North Carolina Highway Patrol in their silver and black uh, of course, uh, you know, police interceptor vehicles here, Wake County EMS with their lights flashing, undercover, uh, of course, uh, sheriff cars and deputy cars. And uh, again, thank you to police, fire and rescue, everybody in this area for what they are doing. Communication National Anthem first, and then we <laughs> Eleven thirteen in the morning kind of a late start but we had a really really loud storm like it actually woke us up so we've been waiting for that to be done and now we're gonna go to found coffee for breakfast and then uh i don't know hopefully have a lot of fun today now at Fount Coffee, just waiting for our food. I got the hot chocolate, so I've got the pumpkin spice latte with almond milk. Wow. You can literally smell the pumpkin spice. I'm so excited. I love their hot chocolate. Sam got, how about you just say what you got so I don't mess it up. The acai smoothie bowl and the caramel apple cake. Nice. Looks so good. So I got the morning scramble with avocado. And this has like cheese, bacon, eggs, and then it's on, I think, Simple Needs bread maybe. And then I got their special apple cinnamon French toast. So I'm very interested to see how that is because I've never had that here before. We are checking out Downtown Apex. Downtown Apex is so cool. It's amazing walking through all the shops and everything here. Lots of really cute boutiques. Obviously there's a church. There's so many churches here in the South and lots of restaurants too. They have a the little free library. So this is the little free library memory of Dolly S. Knowles. Wow, this is adorable. I love that so much. Back here, oh, wrong place, there we go. Back here to get some more chocolate and goodies. Kind of started devouring it before doing a video, but I got two Rice crispy Treats. There's cinnamon roll with cream cheese and then a tag along. And then what did you get? I think you already ate it, but. Uh, the cinnamon roll and some sort of like sweet bread. How was it? It's pretty good. Good? Yeah, this is all really good. Just super hungry. So now we're gonna go to Eureka Culture for some like actual uh, lunch type food. Um, I'm gonna eat this as a snack to kind of hold me over. We just ordered our food from Arupa, Arupa, Arupa Culture. North Carolina, I'm assuming it's what the NC stands for. And we're just waiting for that. I did have a reaction to something I ate. I don't know if it was what I ate or because my hands might have been contaminated since we've been traveling to a lot of different places. I don't know. So I'm kind of recovering from that. Took an allergy med. And we'll see if that helps at all or not. Um, but really excited to try this place out. They're supposed to be dedicated gluten-free. So hopefully um, they're really good. Culture. All right, so I got this one here, which is, I forget what they're all called, but this is chicken salad. It looks like it says, this is either Latika or Reina Papida. I'm probably not saying this correctly. This is chicken salad with mayo and avocado. And this one is like their classic chicken uh, with cheese, peppers, and onions. And then Sam has... Let's see, he has the regular, that same one that I yeah. have on the right. And then what'd you get? Oh, the meat lovers one yeah, where it's just a ton it's of- It's not called that, but it's- It's a ton of different meats. Reaper culture was pretty good. It was a little too spicy for me, which is what I thought would happen. Too much uh, like peppers and onions and everything like that. But it was actually still like really, really good. Sam, I think definitely loved it. Yeah. But that, that's like <clears throat> right up his alley for food. But it was, it was still overall pretty good. So now we're going to JC. Ralston Arboretum. Yeah. Something like I'm not sure if I pronounced that correctly, so excited to check that out. We are now at the JC Ralston Arboretum. 
don't think I'm pronouncing that right still. I'm gonna go check this place out. This place is really, really cool already. This is absolutely gorgeous. Oh, there's fish in here too. Here for the orchid show. Lots and lots of orchids here. All of these displays are so beautiful. This one might be my favorite so far. This place is so cool. There's so many different walking paths and different things to look at. Definitely recommend checking this place out. Definitely really cool. We're just walking through a bunch of the paths. There is so much to see here. This bridge is awesome. Oh, this is so cool. So I was on this bridge, but this tree is right here. So I avoided it and went off there. And then Sam was like, it says, please keep off the gravel. So now I feel really awful. So I am so sorry. I did not know. Uh, fraud named Bob. Yeah, you can see the ants going up the tree. Wow. It's just so beautiful. Beautiful. Everything here. It's amazing. Oh my gosh, there's so much more out there too. Wow. Giant field, lots of paths. That would take a long time to go through everything here. B Hotel. That is really cool. For a minute. Takes off. Yeah. Oh wow. Amazing. There's a wedding going on right now, so you can see one of the gardens, but wow, this place is beautiful. These are really cool bathrooms, we're pretty sure, but like they're actually really cool. Path is so cool. Winter garden down there too. Squirrel. Oh look, he's running over here. Or she. Don't know. Where'd the squirrel go? Oh, it's right above us. Oh, that's so cool. Just watching the squirrel jump through the trees. Absolutely beautiful. Bird flew up here to the top of the tree. This is really cool. Rally Rock is a quick dinner food for a snack. Walking to Mon Macron and found this really cool like waterfall type thing here. It's really nice. It's really cool. Very artistic. And then we're walking to Mont Macron to get some treats. It's been a bit hard to find parking today, but there's just a lot of construction going on around here and it's also a weekend day. So, but we are almost there. Got our goodies. I like my goodies because Sam didn't get anything, but I got one salted caramel, two white chocolate raspberry, and then one mint chocolate chip. And it's actually raspberry white chocolate. I forget what I said before, but I'm so excited to eat these. I struggled to get them out of the box, so this one is a bit messed up already, but I haven't tried the salted caramel yet, so I'm gonna try it now. Hmm. The middle is literally like just caramel. It's pretty rich. So then I have the raspberry white chocolate, which I've had already. Yep, that one's good. Mint chocolate chip, which is like my third time having this one, I think. More soft than last time, so it's probably fresh. It's really, really good. Turn left, then keep right. That is really close to us. It's really cool. Andy has ice cream. We went back to the hotel. It's a little bit of a rest, and now I'm back here. 
I'm gonna BB pop to get some food for tomorrow or tonight. I know how hungry I am. Ice cream was great, and then it's off to bed and back home tomorrow. Just dropped our phone off. 5.54 a.m. We're in the airport. We don't board till 6.50. So now we'll just chill out and wait. 7.23, boarding the plane. Nine forty-five, waiting for our luggage. Nine fifty-one, we are waiting for my luggage. Got my luggage and just waiting to be picked up.